That cat that survived a five story jump from a burning building and then ran away from the scene is now missing. The long leap caught on camera and WGN's Julian Cruz is live in Englewood with more on the search for Hennessy. Hello, Julian. Hello, Lord, is everybody talking about this brave little cat who hasn't been seen after yesterday's dramatic escape from a burning Englewood apartment building. As the search for the missing cat continues, we're learning more about this acrobatic feline who goes by the name of Hennessy. Well, we didn't know if the cat was going to jump or not, but then I guess he got the courage to jump and he jumped. You can hear Karima Yassin and her daughter cry out in astonishment. The male house cat who goes by the name of Hennessy with amazing body control as he somehow manages to land on his feet just like the saying goes. Did. I was screaming. I was like, oh my God. My daughter was screaming too. Onlookers watching as Chicago firefighters break out the window to the burning apartment at 65th and low, and that's when Hennessy decided to jump. Oh my God. Is he going to make it? Is he going to make it over the wall? The brave little feline had to jump out and away from the building in order to clear a 12 foot concrete wall below. Like I said, he just bounced and then he just walked off. Witnesses say the brave little cat seemed to be okay, scampering off before disappearing from view. His owner organizing a canvas of the neighborhood searching for Hennessy, who is said to be all black with a tiny speck of white on his chest. Now, PawsChicago.org, they operate a facility here in Englewood, and they have spayed and neutered more than 16,000 cats and dogs, and they want to help find this cat and provide free veterinary service uh, to the feline. You know, the saying goes that cats always land on their feet, and cats have nine lives, but Paws Chicago telling us that a uh, cat is not indestructible, and uh, they are concerned. They would like to get this cat and make sure that he's okay. In Englewood, Julian Cruz, WGN News.